In anime, people are always the key characters to portray both the world and the ideas that the director conveys in the film. With so many works of art and history, anime has become an integral part of Japanese culture, a feature introduced to the world. Anime movies are not simply a cartoon for children as many worldwide parents have previously thought. It is also an art that can convey very humane messages and emotions that no books can compare. The stories in it always contain human emotions and can get a lot of tears from the audience through empathy. Let's learn with Ask K-Pop Entertainment a great and emotional anime movie called The Girl Who Let Through Time. The Girl Who Leapt Through Time is a 2006 science fiction romantic anime film, directed by Mamoru Hosoda and written by Okudura Satoko. The film is an obscure sequel to Tutsui Yasutaka's novel of the same name. This novel has been made into a TV series, film, and story a number of times. However, this is the first time it has been made into an anime. Madhouse directed the film and Katakawa Herald Pictures distributed the film. Because of its relatively quiet debut, The Girl Who Leapt Through Time was not considered the blockbuster of the year, but the film was considered one of the most successful films of 2006 and received many good reviews in the film festivals. At the 39th SIGES International Film Festival, the film won the title of Best Animated Feature Film and Japan Academy Prize for Animation of the Year. In addition, there are many prestigious international awards. Why is a low-budget anime like The Girl Who Leapt Through Time such a spectacular success? One of the essential reasons is that the creators of this anime have grasped the formula that the most successful movie filmmakers use. Those are the vague, contradictory emotions that always exist in us. Especially, when we are young, sometimes turning us into lost and completely helpless people, from the very aimless regrets, we know what to do to recreate this life. Based on that idea, The Girl Who Leapt Through Time is built with a great scenario. The plot revolves around Kano Makoto, a young schoolgirl who happens to have supernatural powers. Makoto is revealed by her aunt Yoshihara Kazuko that she has the ability to travel through time. Makoto begins to use this power to solve everyone's troubles happening around. Makoto in the anime is easier than in the TV series. A pure and cute girl who is extremely funny. When she was 17 years old, Makoto received the power to jump time. At that age of puberty, when she suddenly had a magical magic in her hand, she used this special ability to correct her own mistakes such as improving her academic performance and relationships with other people. But from then on, her relationship with her two best boyfriends, Kusuk and Chiaki, changed forever. It's a story close to every generation, every period. Everyone has at least once made a mistake, stumbled, and wanted to go back in time to correct and prevent it from happening. This way of building Makoto's character with this special ability hits the viewer's dreamy psychology, stimulating curiosity about the next development. 
The emotional levels in Makoto's psyche are changed logically and convincingly and are pushed up and broken in the ending. Love, friendship, and respect for time are subtly exploited in the film story. Makoto didn't think much of what she had done until she heard from her aunt that it might hurt others. From there, Makoto realized that every time history was changed. Someone else would take the risks she should have taken herself. The part where Makoto ran to stop Kusuk and Keio's car was very suspenseful and touching. The music was pounding as Makoto ran to stop the car, then all the sounds seemed to die off except for Makoto's frightened voice. Finally, Makoto gets a chance to correct what she did wrong. Makoto knew how to take advantage of that unique opportunity to do what she had to do before, as well as Yuri's silent reminder. Makoto, time waits for no one inch. The drawing is suitable for Makoto, that childish way of thinking is suitable for the behavior of a teenage girl with no clear direction for the future. Mikoto uses the ability just to do very, normal things. The message time waits for no one is always true at any time. Anyone who is born will also grow up, going through a tumultuous adolescence when psychology and emotions change. That period will eventually pass after the first setbacks and make room for maturity. Because perhaps as you grow older, you will understand, regret, bad luck or luckiness. All is the part of this life. Face what is happening with the same passiveness as you are. Perfection is present. Perfection is the twists and turns in life that don't need you to go back and fix them. Time goes on so that at a time, everything is just memories, happy sad memories. Without explaining any truths or lessons, through 98 minutes, director Mamoru Hosoda used cinematic language to give viewers emotions and reflections on time. Lessons behind a God-given talent sooner or later, Makoto gradually has to face changing situations happening around her when she changes a few details to her liking in the past to have the future she wants. Like stopping her best friend Chiaki from confessing, acting for her best friend Kusuk and another girl. When the number of times she could reverse time was over, she discovered that she jumped in time to escape the train accident. However, it was her childhood friend who borrowed that bike without brakes, who appeared on the very road the train passed at that time. Confused, worried, scared. A Makuto who cried easily and laughed easily, like the next-door neighbor that any audience feels sympathetic. The plot of everyday life is too idyllic, sometimes a bit boring, but believe me, the second, third time you watch this movie you will feel bored that is our life. Now we understand why this work has won so many awards. It is like the Oscar anime in the hearts of many people. In short, the three problems are also the three lessons that the teenage girl has to face and solve in the movie are. Number 1. In a race, there are winners, there will be losers, and the losers are always the ones who always avoid the most risks. Number 2. You are always faced with dilemmas in life. For example, a guy you like likes you, but your best friend likes him. To avoid trouble, usually shy girls will intentionally put the two together. As a result, because of your emotional dishonesty with yourself and with your loved one, you quietly watch them come together. They are not very happy but your youth is also wasted. Number 3. 
you can't be sure which is the perfect choice, so you just use your timeless powers to solve problems for everyone and for yourself. However, in the end, you realize that deciding to follow your heart is the best choice. The most attractive thing about this anime is that the director has let the viewers always have to choose together with the characters and the audience's emotions are rising every moment with every development, every detail, detail, even every very small movement of the character. The script, emotions, and images of the film are enough to score 9 out of 10. And the 10 points for this anime movie are the perfect, sweet ending. The ending that has the ability to cherish emotions, helping the audience fully enjoy the echo of a masterpiece. The film has a cast that sounds natural and professional, from the silly and childish Makoto. There's something mature and warm about Chiaki. The soundtrack was held up as if holding on as if wanting to keep an indescribable feeling of lightheadedness. The characters mainly consist of Makoto and his two best male friends. Makoto wants to enjoy his life with his two friends without anything changing. Shiaki and Kusuk tend to spend most of their time studying with Makoto. The relationship between the three people is less developed when things are inadvertently repeated many times. In addition, Makoto's girlfriend is Yuri, a group of girls in the volunteer club, and a few other characters that support the main character very well. Not simply a dry science fiction story, the girl who leapt through time skillfully interweaves the first thoughts and vibrations of boys and girls at a young age, still surprised but still confused. Also very honest and sincere. Bringing a gentle but profound message about trust, friendship, love, and teacher-student love, the girl who leapt through time is definitely an indispensable movie for those who want to relive the pure youth years. Thank you for watching today's video. If you find this video good, please like, share, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to support Ask K-Pop Entertainment to make more exciting videos.